welcome back everyone. This is my five day trips across the central part of uh, Cambodia and then we continue to the northern plain of the country. So at the grassland we saw storks, ducks and beautiful plants. Continue to uh, the northern plain of the country where I went to Beatrit uh, adventure place. There's so many wildlife there. Beatrice Adventure located in Brevihir province and right here it, it was the place where we so enjoy with numbers of birds that came you know to this spot. When we drove the car and when we get to the point you can't believe what you are uh, watching, what you are seeing. There's so many, many red jungle fowls and also the beautiful uh, Siamese fireback and with so many, many squirrels that come here to feed on, you know, the rice that we gave them. This is so amazing, I can't believe it. We really enjoy it. Not very far from this place, there is an ancient reservoir where so many whistling ducks, they reside and they just feed here quietly and peacefully without fear. This time, we are very lucky. We witnessed the most beautiful green pea fowl. At this time, the sun almost rise up and the light just perfect. There are two green pea fowls. They're still cleaning, preening, checking the feathers while the other flew down to the ground. Not at all one of the dominant male he started to display and he kind of showing his beauty to the other uh, female around him it is such a most amazing and beautiful footage that i can get around here at this time
Living from the Beatrice Adventure, we continue to Braybank Village, which is one of the very isolated areas. So we are driving along this kind of the dry deep Toroka forest. We are going to enjoy the beautiful nature and especially we are looking for the hidden ancient infrastructure. The beautiful Jensram temple was hiding in the forest many years. Right here is the Bangtual Vulture Restaurant. It's located inside Chai Bala Sanctuary and it is very close to Laos border. We to this place. We saw the vultures and it is very productive for their owls. So here we have the brown wood owl that roosting somewhere in a very dense tree but accidentally it was flushed when we arrived to the spot and also the Asian bat outlet he was chased by the small sooty headed bulbul and in the night time we can see the very cute oriental scops owl first it called and after that we started to follow the, the sound and then we saw it. Thank you so much my friend. Thank you for watching this video and please do not forget to subscribe and like this video and we will see you again for uh, the next video. Happy New Year!